So here we are breaking up camp. Um, let's talk a little bit about how we like to take down our tents. Um, we talk about how we like to put them up. A lot of people say that with these uh, sill nylon tents you should just uh, stuff them in the stuff stack and not fold them or anything. Um, that's fine. We kind of disagree a little bit. It's a little uh, breezy out. So you'll notice Angie here is taking down the pole. We like to zip everything up. And um, instead of actually um, just stuffing it in the sack, we find that it's neater if you do kind of a roll method. Um, the roll method also has the advantage of that it doesn't cause a lot of wrinkles when you first have the TP out. There's very few folds. If you do kind of the roll method but do it a little different each time, you won't be folding it in a consistent manner. So anyway, Angie's here. She's taking out the stakes, going around. Um, this is all pretty simple. If we get a if we get a good gust of wind, don't be surprised. It's been windy at times down here. <laughs> As I said, it's been a little uh, windy down here. Here's Eli, he's um, watching what the tent learning. And um, we are right now down in Red, yes. where it's very windy. One thing I really like about this uh, roll-up method is that it um, folds down really small. And like I said, it doesn't come out wrinkly when you um, bring the tent out either. Helping you. Since it's rolled, there's not, not going to be a whole lot of wrinkles when you uh, bring it out of the bag. And, um, it's going to create a very compact package. Thanks, helper. Okay, if you notice this guy on the knee, it's falling off. And there you have it, six-person TV.